Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Truth Be Told. Don't mind my role as y'all. I'm just keeping it real. Heavenly Father, thank you for giving us this opportunity to seek you, to seek your face, Father God. I pray that you reveal yourself to us, Lord, in the glorious name of Jesus. I pray that you talk to us, Father God, that your words fall on fertile ground and that it bears much fruit for your kingdom, my King. Lord, open our eyes, open our ears to see the truth, Father God, that help us make us free today in the glorious mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hey, everybody. Thank you for joining me. So in Proverbs 23, 7, it says, as a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. I talk a lot about as we think. We need to watch what we think. We need to think on purpose. Uh, so we're going to have a think session today. We should all take the time to think about what we think about on a daily basis. If you're not thinking about what you're thinking about, you're going to continue thinking and aligning yourself up with the devil, honey. Uh, we need to speak out loud and agree with God, right? And I'm telling you, if you, if you do this every day, you're going to start to transform the way you think, which will transform how you speak, which will transform how you act. It's just, it's all connected, y'all. But we have to get to the root of what, how we think. And when we think, just test what you think about daily. Just take what you thought about today. Take today and think about what you thought about yesterday. And think about if any of those things or how many of those things aligned with what God says. How he says we should think. How he says we should talk. And we'll be surprised, man. I was surprised when I did that. So things, say things like, this is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. See, I say things like, I'm looking forward to blessing someone today. I look for opportunities to show God's goodness, to show God's faithfulness through me. I actually look for opportunities. It takes my mind off of my life because I know that God is taking care of everything that I need. So it's a beautiful synergy, you know. I'm out there doing God's will and God's taking care of everything I need. So it works out pretty good for me. Uh, your thoughts, your words shall be accepting to God. So I say, Lord, let my words, my thoughts be accepting to you today. I have a mind like Christ. I think on purpose. I have the mind of Christ. See, I get excited to see God perform his promises in my life. I don't know about y'all, but I get excited. Ask anybody who knows me. I'm excited every day because I know that God performs miracles today. You know, we just have to be open to see them. I pray today that God opens your eyes, that you start to walk in alignment with him, that you start to think on purpose and you start to speak what God asks you to speak. I say and I speak about these messages a lot because this is the foundation, guys. Your foundation of your stinking thinking. If you continue to think the way you do and it's not in alignment with God, you're never going to get to the place where God has created you to be. You're never going to walk in the fullness of your purpose. And wouldn't that be ashamed? Oh, I pray today that you walk in the purpose that God created you for today. In the glorious mighty name of Jesus. Honey, I'm on Purpose Road and uh, Sanctity Avenue. Where you at? Holla.